Hello guys, back again. So I just, like I said, um, I was gonna show you guys my next grocery haul, especially because I'm doing this like dieting phase right now. So I'm trying to cut down a little bit and I think it's helpful. People always say it's helpful to see kind of like what I'm eating or how I'm like doing my meals and whatnot when I'm trying to cut down. So I just went to the store and I'm gonna show you guys everything that I got. Also update, today is April 21st maybe and I woke up almost a pound lighter, so that's very exciting. I wrote that down. I'm now 169.0, and I'm about 5'7", for those of you who care. So I'm excited, and I'm motivated, and it's really nice out, and it's a good weekend, so I'm just really happy and ready um, to continue on strong with this dieting phase. So let's go ahead and show you guys what I got. Well, I have, they didn't have the Simply Potatoes at the store, so I got these diced hash brown potatoes, and they're actually better because you can get two thirds of a cup for 60 calories, where the other ones were one half cup for 70 calories. So it's a little bit better there. So I'm excited for that. I got canned peaches. Um, my mom always has these at their house, at her house, and they're so good. So I needed to just get some for myself. I got spicy black beans to put with my rice and beans and avocado and Cholula mixture that I do almost every day for lunch. And with that, I got some brown rice to go along with it. When you buy it like this, you can cook it in a over the stove and it's a lot better than the microwave ones in my opinion. I got some chicken salad, obviously not vegan and I'll still make that video about why I'm doing that, but I'm starting to incorporate more animal products again. So this chicken salad is amazing and for half of this entire huge container it's only 400 calories so i could eat like technically half of this on toast or something so that's exciting i'm so pumped for that grape tomatoes tomato onion three two potatoes cucumber stuff i eat throughout the week like for carbs and recipes burgers just put like everything but the bagel seasoning on here and of course i got some baby spring mix i either put cook this on the stove or in salad more likely on the stove with some salt pepper and garlic powder um, lemons for my water i got some sliced deli turkey i'm gonna put some sliced cheese on the here probably and make like bagel sandwiches 110 calories better than the other bagels i had and then I have these turkey burgers that are seasoned. Um, I have a lot of turkey now because I'm just deciding to eat chicken and turkey again. So pretty good, 190 calories. Got some bananas. I got these protein chips again because they were really good last time. This almond butter is sadly always about $10 and it's an investment that you just kind of have to make. But it's a lot better than peanut butter in my opinion. And then I got these LaCroix grapefruit waters. I had the sparkling ice waters that I always get, but they have sucralose in them. And so they gave me a huge headache and I was sad. So I'm going to try these. They don't have sucralose in them. And I think I'm pretty sensitive to preservatives. So that's why I'm going to try these. I was trying to find just one can, but apparently you can't just buy one can anywhere, which is a whole nother thing. So then over here, I just got more hot sauce, Cholula and Louisiana is so good. And then up here I have some yogurts. These are really good. I'm gonna probably put the sliced peaches in here. And I got some turkey bacon. Another sandwich I could do with these bagel fins is the turkey bacon and potatoes and maybe some cheese and hot sauce and it'd be really good. Then some other kind of more like bodybuilding type of stuff that I got. I got this protein sample for mocha because I already have a chocolate and a peanut butter protein powder. So I wanted to try like a coffee flavor. And then I also got this ghost coffee ice cream. If you guys watch Christian Guzman, I know he uses them a lot as well as Max Tuning. So I'm excited to try it for the first time. I also got these cake bites about, they're about 200 calories and I figured I would just try them because they looked pretty good. Got some lean body shakes, 40 grams of protein, pretty good macros, and obviously these are real dairy, so we'll see how my stomach reacts to them. And some Walden Farms pancake syrup, it's zero calories and everything, and it's good on them. Obviously like pancakes or waffles if you make protein waffles or that type of thing. And the last couple things I got back here are some Power Crunch bars. These are really good, especially if you put them in the freezer. And then RX bars. Ooh, if I don't drop it in the sink. RX bars, they're also really good and they're pretty good in the fridge. 
Hello YouTube, I realized I didn't do any type of outro or closing for this clip. I'm outside right now and it's super nice. I'm at my mom's house if this doesn't look familiar um, to you guys, not in my kitchen as normal. But if you guys enjoyed that grocery haul, um, I finally came up with a series name for this cut down that I'm doing. I'm gonna call it the Summer Slim Down. So I'm gonna start putting that in the titles of the videos and put like episode one, episode two. So the last few videos that are on my channel have all been a part of this summer slim down series but I'm not gonna put the episode name in there because I didn't officially name it until this video so I'll this will be episode one of that and then the ones that continue will be episodes like two three blah 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 so with that I hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know what other content you'd like to see and things like that and then if you like this video, remember to give it a thumbs up. It helps support my channel and click the little bell notification. That will let you know when I post a new video. Thank you guys so much. I hope you have a great day, a great weekend, and enjoy life. Love you guys. Last thing I forgot to mention in this clip about my grocery haul. I, so I get groceries. I was gonna mention the importance of kind of like habits. So every Saturday I get groceries and it's a good habit because then I know that I'm going to go throughout this go through this food throughout the week and then run out I have to go on Saturday and then I just spend all the money on Saturday and after that I don't have to like buy I don't go out to eat a lot during the week so I spend all the money at once but then I have enough food for the whole week so that's very important to just pick one day and kind of be consistent with it so that and then I also will do my dishes on Sunday I wait the whole week to do my dishes on Sunday till after I meal prep on Sundays and cook stuff for the week and then I also random but I do my laundry on Fridays so this has been my habit for a really long time and it helps me kind of stay successful and stay on top of everything in my life besides like school and work and all those other things so that's kind of just something that's helpful that I thought I could mention if you guys aren't already in a routine of doing that it's definitely really important and it can help you out so now I'm actually done see you later